Now, you were the lead author on the paper that really tried to uh, constrain what trappist oneis atmosphere is. Um, can you tell us a bit about what the models suggested? Sure. So I think the biggest takeaway is that it's still equally likely that trappist one e has an atmosphere versus doesn't have an atmosphere. We only observed the planet with four transits, which was only ever enough to kind of detect potentially a hint of an atmosphere. So the question with our data was, if we assume there is an atmosphere, what kind of constraints can we place on it? Mm -hmm. um, and so we came up with this scenario where it's really well fit by a neutral background gas like nitrogen, which makes up a lot of Earth's atmosphere, with another absorber that could be something like methane, which is common in Titan's atmosphere. Oh, okay, okay. And I, I remember seeing in the paper that it's probably not not Mars-like in, atmos in, in atmosphere or Venus-like. That's absolutely correct. So the molecule that's probably the most detectable in this type of planet um, over the range of wavelengths that we looked at is carbon dioxide, which is highly abundant in Mars and Venus's atmosphere. Hmm. And we didn't see any evidence for it. That doesn't mean it's not there, but just with a fourth transit observation, we don't yet see it. So that kind of starts to rule out different regions of parameter space.